How's it going everyone? Welcome back. Your FaceTime doesn't work on your iPhone after the recent update or you just simply cannot use your FaceTime on your iPhone. So in today's video, I'll exactly show you how to solve the FaceTime doesn't work on iPhone. If it's crashing, connecting, or if it's not even activating, you can watch this simple video to learn everything that is absolutely necessary to solve any problems on FaceTime. So without wasting any more time, let's go. The first things we are going to take a look at is the network. So most problem happen on your FaceTime is because of the poor network connections. So you can head over to your Safari browser here and simply type uh, fast dot com so let me type fast.com here and this website will let you know how much speed you're currently getting on your iphone if it's uh, it's pretty low then you can swap down from the top here enable airplane mode for the quick reset for the network or you can simply you know uh, switch your network if you're using wi-fi go back and you know, enable mobile data or you can do the vice versa to see if that works or not all right so let's go to the next process which is pretty important especially for the facetime call so all you got to do we got to head over to the settings got to tap on apple id here select sign in and security this might ask you for the passcode so you got to put it right here and then once you come to this space you can see the number and especially if you just try to connect or cannot activate your FaceTime with phone number, you have to take a look at this. It says unavailable for iMessage and FaceTime. So that means this number is not being able to, I cannot use it on the FaceTime. So to solve that problem, I got to remove that number and I need to re-add the number from my iPhone. So once you're going to re-add the phone number, tap down here, go back and scroll down to the bottom, select apps and find out your FaceTime. So let me search here, select FaceTime and now scroll down here. So make sure you're actually activating your FaceTime. The best thing that you guys can really do to solve FaceTime problems, you can turn up your FaceTime entirely for about 30 to 40 seconds then turn it back on again and when you are just turning it back on wait for some time select apple id so make sure you're actually activating with your apple id here and make sure you're selecting either your apple id or the phone number as you can see from here now after that just get out of here and restart your iphone you're all good to go now this is very common but still if you have problems that there are two things that you guys can still do to solve the problem first just go to settings, scroll down here, select general, and you gotta select iPhone storage and find out your FaceTime. So let me type FaceTime here, tap offload, tap upload again, and then tap reinstall the app. Go back here, and this time you gotta scroll down, select date and time, make sure you're selecting correct date and times on your iPhone. And the last thing we're gonna take a look at is the region. Sometimes it might give you an error, especially if you're choosing the incorrect region. Since I'm from Bangladesh, I'm selecting Bangladesh for myself. If you're from anywhere else, go and change your location from here. Hope that would work to solve your problems on your iPhone. Still have a question? Please let me know in the comment section. See you guys around.